Dr. Robert Neerum helped pioneer the field of bioengineering in the United States. He's advanced health science by studying blood flow and the mechanisms of cell growth. Neerum, a professor emeritus at Georgia Tech, is also a mentor who draws young people to science and engineering. Robert Neerum earned his bachelor's degree at the University of Oklahoma. He attended Ohio State for a PhD in aeronautical and astronautical engineering and then joined the faculty. Neerum did shockwave research and one day NASA invited him to consult on the effects of vibration on astronauts. For Neerum, it opened a window to how engineering could be applied to the life sciences. Neerum began attending physiology classes and seminars in medicine, and then he went to London's Imperial College to learn from a group that was studying fluid dynamics in the body. When he returned to Ohio State, Neerum redirected his research. The first of his new studies were measurements of the velocity of blood flow across coronary arteries. In 1979, Neerum moved to the University of Houston to chair the Mechanical Engineering Department. He took a new step in blood flow research, studying how endothelial cells, which line the arteries, respond to shear stress and the link to arterial disease. Ten years later, Neerum relocated to Georgia Tech to help build a new program in bioengineering and he became the founding director of the Institute for Bioengineering and Bioscience. Neerum also helped promote biomedical engineering among policymakers and helped start the American Institute for Medical and Biological Engineering and became its founding president. Neerum's recent work spans tissue engineering and regenerative medicine, including studies of how stem cells respond to mechanical stimuli, and also how stem cells could lead to replacement blood vessels. Neerum is also a mentor. He established an undergraduate research program for students from all of Atlanta's universities. And more recently, Neerum spearheaded the Engages program to introduce underrepresented minority high school students to careers in science and engineering. For contributions to our understanding of the dynamics of blood flow, to the development of tissue engineering and regenerative medicine, and for leading the way for engineers to contribute to the advancement of medicine, ASME welcomes Dr. Robert M. Neerum as an honorary member. <laughs>